Hi everyone and welcome to the CKC at home edition trade show. I'm Janet and I'm here for Islet Outlet. Today I'm going to be showing you all kinds of 3D and card making projects using our products. Stay tuned to the very end because I'm going to be debuting a brand new Brad release that you aren't going to want to miss. Also, we have a sale and I'll talk about that in a minute. All right, well, let's get going. I gotta move down to my desk, so here we go. We have a fantastic show special for you today. It is good through 9-6 and it's 20% off of everything in the store, including sale and clearance merchandise. Just use code BROOKRULES and to do so by the end of September 6th. So let's take a look at this beautiful fall card. This one is from Leslie Turner and she's created a wreath made out of die cut branches and then she's decorated it with our leaf brads and then also our scarecrow brads. So you can see how pretty that is. Really cool. And then the background, this pretty background is not paper, it's actually washi tape. And this one is called Autumn Washi Tape. It's one of the newer ones in the store. I'm going to show you inside she's got it more so you can see it without it being covered. You can see the pretty red berries and the little coffee cup. And then down here we've got some acorns. And then there's also mushrooms. You can see a little bit of that down here. So it's really a pretty washi tape. The next card is a sentiment that I can relate to because I feel like I've, I say this to myself every once in a while. If I only had a brain, I wouldn't have forgotten your birthday. Uh, and this is really cute. And again, you see another use for the scarecrow. But down here we have a set I haven't shown you before or yet, and that's the uh, tractor and trailer Brad set. And it comes uh, with a couple different colors, but of course the green tractor reminds you of a certain brand if you're familiar with tractors. And then also we've got a couple pieces of thin washi tape here. This is a striped washi, brown and white stripe. And then this one is uh, the skinny yellow washi tape. So that's that one. So I wanted to show you this really cute 3D item. It's actually a little box and Susan Creech has put this together and it just opens on the side like that. And you could put a couple pieces of candy or something in there. But I think this would be wonderful for a table place setting, you know, with your name, names of your guests on every plate for Thanksgiving. Um, you can find out how to make this. Just go to our, uh, the Islet Outlet blog and search for pie and you'll get the full instructions for this. It's really quite simple and you can make these up quickly. Um, and then instead of putting Bella, just put their name on there. Wouldn't that be great? So the products used on this one, besides just cardstock, is going to be the pumpkin washi tape on the sides. And then um, this is the pumpkin bread set, which is perfect for this little, little treat box. So there's that one. Moving on to a few Halloween specific items. This is a cute little stair step card, again by Susan. And Susan Creech did a bunch of uh, Halloween cards that you're going to see here next. So just keep that in mind. But she used on this one the witch's legs, the broom from the broom and brad set, and then also this witch's hat, which this is the set that has color in it. There's also a set that's just black. So there's, there's that. So super cute, fun 3D type card. It's, the st step cards are real fun. And again, if you search on Google for step cards, you're going to find lots of instructions. Here's another one featuring the broom brads, and this again is part of the broom and vacuum brad set. So it's not Halloween really specific, but we have a lot of fun with it during Halloween. And I want to show you the vacuum that goes with it. So here's another one, you totally made my day, and that's the vacuum. So super, super cute. Um, and this is also by Susan Creech as well. Then I've got a little uh, joke card here, where do ghosts go fishing? And on this we have the ghost brad set, the fishing pole brad set, and the fish brad set. Inside it says Lake Erie. So that's where ghosts go fishing is Lake Erie. Uh, pretty cute, right? And then I've got a couple tags for you. So these are so perfect for little treat bags or little gifts that you're doing for your trick-or-treaters this year. And this one has our pumpkin brad set again and our ghosts on there. And just a little tip, if you don't want your prongs to show through, just make sure that you insert your prongs on the paper that's going to be glued on uh, as the sentiment on your tag. And that way, once you've glued it down, all those prongs are covered up and you can't tell that they are even there. So 
that's a great tip as well. Just make sure you do that before you glue it down. Here are a pair of wizard cards from Lauren Burgold. And we have a couple of these wizard type sets in the store, so I want to brief you on them. There is one called the wizard set, and that includes glasses, scarf, and wand. So there's the glasses, the scarf, and the wand. The wand is also used here. Uh, then also there is the wizard hat and lightning bolt uh, set. And so there's the, Liz, the lightning bolt and the wizard hat. And we also see the wizard hat down here. Now, also included on these cards, we've got the sketched owl, and then we've got a bunch of washi tapes and bling. So starting over here, this bling is our swirl clear bling, and she's also used star sequins to make that magic pop out of the wand. Then in the background, we've got uh, star washi. This is glitter. And then also back here is silver star glitter washi, and so that created her mats. Then over here, we have the copper glitter washi and just copper shiny glitter washi. And then that star is called gold star washi. So uh, all that together makes some pretty magical looking cards. Here's another fun treat box from Susan Creech. And remember, we have tool brads of all type, including screw brads. So in this case, Susan used them to decorate her Frankenstein monster treat box. Don't forget that when you're working on your own Frankenstein projects during the holiday season. Susan Creech created this adorable witch's shoe out of cardstock using a pattern from Cricut in the Princess Party uh, design collection. So what she did with this is uh, when she created it using a 12 by 12 piece of paper, she found it was just perfect to hold a sleeve of Oreos. And she's decorated that treat bag with um, a little tag that has the witch's legs and also some single purple bling. And then this medallion also features the mini, the little mini um, spiders. So cute. Here's another version of that that's even more interesting. This is using the special orange filled Oreos, so it looks pretty cool in that black, uh, in that black box. But then she created a different tag for this one that features the, the bat uh, set that we have. You can also skip the treats and just put in a little sock set too. And you get a different look from that. So all in all, it's a really cute little uh, project to be made for the Halloween season and your little ghosties. Well, as we know, October is also the month for breast cancer awareness, and I have a couple cute projects from Susan Creech here. The first is a card, and it says, Save the Boobies. It includes our ghost brads, and also we have a breast cancer awareness ribbon quicklet. So that's something you should be aware of if you'd like to do anything and use that, that brad. Also, there's a cute little hanging angel that she created, and this is using basically uh, portions of rosettes to create the shape. And she's used a sentiment here that you could substitute with any kind of encouraging sentiment. Again, you see the quicklet, and then her skirt is decorated with the fancy long bling and pearl and clear. And we've she's also used a little bit of thin glitter washi at the top for her halo. So she's really cute as well. These are great projects for uh, breast cancer awareness. One of the new Brad releases from the summer was the barbecue uh, set which has grills and aprons in it. And so this is one that I did and I include two of the grills plus one of the aprons. The aprons come in blue, orange, and red. So the orange uh, apron is really handy for using um, you know, with our tool breads for guys that are handy with tools and like to do things with their with their hands or work on cars or whatever. And then also included in this uh, card are the, the flat finish black enamel dots and then also the shaped enamel dots in hearts here in red. So that's just a fun little word play on the fact that a shish kebab sort of looks like a weapon. The next one with the grill involved is this one from Susan Creech. She has combined a lot of our brads together here to make a great uh, mail card. So in addition again to that grill, she's used the fish from the trout and bass set. The fire and the tent is from the camping set. Then we have the pine tree, summer pine tree. And then the sneakers come from the sneaker and, and water bottle set. 
So, you know, we have a lot of brads for all kinds of activities and interests, especially for the guys. So in addition to all the outdoorsy stuff, we also have all the sports things you can imagine. And um, we also even have beer. So if your guy likes that and just likes to watch sports, it works for that too. So anyway, that's a couple of those for you. This grilling and chilling card from Lauren Burgold includes the barbecue grill and the apron. And then going from top to bottom, we have the sun and clouds brad set, the beach umbrella set, and of course, our beer set. Lauren did an awesome job combining all of these into a fun card for the guy in your life. So another new set that we got this summer was the Record Brad set. And so this one's from Leslie Turner. She created her background with her brick washi tape and a few strips of our wood washi tape. And then of course she used several of the records from the record set and they come with small and larger records so she could make that. And it says, happy birthday dude, you are a limited edition, which is pretty sweet. And inside here she just carried another strip of that wood washi. So I thought that was pretty cool. And here's a cute one from Jeanette Cloyd. She uh, used our record set and our music notes set on this card, as well as our star foil washer at the bottom. Isn't this cute? Thank you. Thank you very much. We all know who says that and who was famous for that. And then we have one from Don Mercedes. It's very different, um, but really cool because she used some vintage maps to, to uh, decorate her card with. And then she used uh, vintage cars, that's their vintage car set, the women's eyeglass brad set, and the record brad set. So pretty neat. Another set that we put out earlier this spring was the unicorn and rainbow set. And here Jeanette Cloyd has created a card using those uh, unicorns. And then this red glitter background is also our washi tape. So pretty neat little combo there, sparkle and never fade. Earlier this spring, we put out a new Sloth and Koala Brad set. These are the Sloths. This card is from Lauren Burgold, and she used our coordinating Sloth washi tape for the background. She made this by applying the strips of washi tape, one on top of the other on a piece of cardstock, cut it out, and then even sewed on the edges of it. She also used, of course, the three Sloths in this card on a printed uh, sentiment of Let's Hang Out. She also sewed uh, the cording that the sloths are hanging on, but you could also recreate this with just using a marker. Super cute. This card from Don Mercedes features our koala from the Sloth and Koala Brad set. It also includes the bright balloon set and it uses clear bling and clear sequins to decorate this card. It also uses the thin yellow and green washi tape on the bottom and side of the card. This card features the sloth from the Sloth and Koala Brad set. It also has the pine tree in the background. The heart you'll notice is glittered, and this is our glitter washi tape mix of both just the red glitter and then also a strip of the heart and white glitter washi tape. This is put down on a piece of cardstock and then cut out either with a steel die or with an electronic cutting machine. Also, we've got a thin strip of green washi here and a heart enamel dot. The background is wood, but we have a wood washi tape that you could use instead of that as well. This perfectly retro tea is for tea party card by Susan Creech includes that famous tea set. Remember the tea sets we used to get as kids? Well, this one has the teacup set inside of it as well as the spoon from the silverware set. Then seated in the chairs are the teddy bear brad and the sock monkey brad and of course another teapot is sitting on the table just love this retro fun card that susan created this next card is from jeanette cloyd and she's used the bluebird from the bluebird and robin set we've got a blue enamel dot there in the heart shape and we've got our dogs from the puppy brad set and then we've also got the black glitter enamel dots Finally, there's a strip of grass washi in there for those doggies to sit in. Well, like that. It's very clever to put the grass in there like that. Next, we have one from Jeanette Cloyd again, and this is Moose You Big Time. This includes a few different brad sets as well. We've got the Moose Brad. We've got the Summer Tree. Oops, that's a Summer Tree Brad. Sorry, and then there's the Pine Tree Brad set too. And then we've got three of our green enamel dots in there. 
The background is not paper. Again, that is our wood washi tape. Pretty cool, huh? And after she applied the washi tape to a piece of cardstock, she cut it out with her steel die so that she could get the imprints of the stitching in there. And I think you can make that out. So there you go. Here's a special card from Susan Matthews. And this is for all the everyday heroes in our life that make things better right now. So representing the various professions, we have the first responders with the ambulance, fire truck, and police car. Then we've got the people growing our food, represented by the tractor. The tool represents all the people keeping our everything running. And the healthcare profession with the stethoscope. The letters are accented with a strip of our clear bling and underneath that a smaller strip of our glitter washi tape. This totally retro card from Susan Creech features several of our products. First you'll notice the red and white hearts in various sizes. Those are our enamel dots and they do come in not only many colors but also sizes so they're very versatile. The rolling pin is from our pan and rolling pin set. The mixer is from our mixer and cup brad set. The flower canister is from our canister brad sets. And there's also a pink washi tape on this one. I just love the old fashioned feeling of this. It's great. Here I've got a cute card from Lauren Burgold that includes our beer products. So what we've got on this one, in this happy birthday card, is our beer brad. So you get the two bottles of beer and a mug in that set. So it's really fun to make a little scene there. The background in this bar scene uh, looks like a wallpaper and a counter, but the wallpaper background is really our beer washi. And then, of course, the counter is our wood washi. And once that was applied to a piece of cardstock, Lauren was able to just cut that out in a circle and place it on her card. Back here, we have our ever versatile brick washi as well. This next one is from Lauren Burgold and it features our dinosaur brad set that are inset in these circles. It says Roar, that's dinosaur for happy birthday. This one is a cute farm card. This is the tractor and trailer brad set again. Remember I showed green before. Well this comes also in red in that set. And of course we have the cow brads. We've got a couple tree brad sets. There is the summer tree and the pine tree. And then there's some thin washi tape here um, that's three strips of that right there on the card. So there you go. This one is from Susan Creech. It's a great retirement card. Goodbye tension. Hello pension. And uh, what we've used here, what she used was the retro typewriter and the retro telephone. And she also used mini gold round uh, Brad's there too. Now this one is from Don Mercedes. Thanks so much. And she's used in the background here the tape measure washi tape. Then there is the dress form Brad's, the thread Brad set, and the scissor Brad set. I know sometimes we get questions um, during our presentations about having sewing uh, products, and we do. So this is just a great example of some of the things that we have regarding sewing. And I've got another fun card here. It's really simple, so it would be quick to do yourself. Um, the sentiment says, life without you is unbearable. Of course, you could use any kind of bear pun type, uh, or even just hello would be fine here. Um, but anyway, we've got the bear brad set, which has the little bear, and then either the papa or mama bear, whichever way you want to look at it. And then the sun from the sun and, or sorry, the clouds from the sun and cloud brad set. There is a new cloud washi tape that she used here. And then also this thin green uh, washi tape. And then last, there's a little white and black washi tape on the edge. All right, we're going to switch gears a little into the next holiday that everybody loves, of course, which is the Christmas and, uh, you know, winter holidays. So these are three really cute tags made by Susan Creech. They're all three shaker style. So let's take a look at them. This first one has the Mr. and Mrs. Claus set on it as well as their sleigh brad. Pretty cute. This one has our polar bear set on it. That's got the like a, a mama or papa polar bear and the cub. 
And then here we've got the pine tree brad and the deer brad set. So, so cute. I love these and they'd be so great on packages and then later they could be used as uh, ornaments. All right, well, here's another card using the Polar Bear set. You see them down here. This card is from Leslie Turner, and I want to just put it out. There you go. You can see how the snow is actually just torn strips of white paper. And then this beautiful mountain background, which just fits the theme of this card so well, is a new washi tape, and it's called Mountain Washi. I want to show that to you real quick. It is an inch and three quarters wide, so look at how wide that is and um, it's got these beautiful winter scenes and with this nice white background it will blend just seamlessly into white paper the way that it did here i think it's one of the most awesome new ones that we've gotten in the store and then uh, this pretty snowflake is the inch and a half size snowflake there's three sizes uh, a larger one this size and then smaller ones in different colors uh, so anyway that's a, a great card love that Next, uh, this, this one is almost all washi tape that you're seeing here. And this one is um, from Lauren Burgold. She was just very clever in how she did this. So the glitter washies that you see here are, are one of the most popular glitter washies we have. And that's called Tree Glitter Washi. And look at when you rub your fingers on this, nothing comes up. And that's the same with all of our glitter washies. She also used Santa washi and some brick washi. And here again is that inch and a half size uh, snowflake. And then a single washi or a single bling, clear bling on the eye. In the background, we have our Merry Christmas washi. So as you can see, that is really a lot of washi, but used so nicely together. Now here is a closer look at this tree washi. It is gorgeous. Look at that shine and shimmer. And uh, this is an inch and an eighth, so it's nice and wide, makes great scenes. And again, you see, I'm not lying, there is not one grain coming off of that. So you can get all that beautiful glitter without any of that mess. And another one from Jeanette, what she did in this one is she used our holiday light brads and strung them on a piece of gold cording. And then holding everything up are the holly brads. So, very cute and simple but clever as well and I love the green that she chose for this one alright I've got some more Christmas cards from Jeanette Cloyd on um, this one we have the holiday bling that's all this green and red bling you see here as well as this little piece we have lots of bling uh, great stuff for the everyday but also for the holidays and that's a good example of it then also we've got the wreath brads there and then the Santa and Mrs. Claus Brad set Christmas washi right there here's another one cleverly done by Jeanette and this has the sleigh brads as well as the Santa suit brads and then there's some plaid washi tape mixed in with some skinny green washi tape on that one Here's a big 5x7 from Susan Matthews called A Winter Gathering Place. This big snowflake is the largest snowflake in our holiday snowflake line. It is 2 inches wide, so it really is a nice statement on a card. In addition, we have all these pine tree brads. We have the truck brad, the classic car brads, um, our cute uh, nutcracker brads, the snow people brads or snowman brads, and then the deer brad and then there is a bunch of single bling on here there's the red single bling on top of all the trees and then the clear single bling she's put strategically in the stars of the paper background she's used so super beautiful love that next up i have a card from jeanette cloyd again and it's dear santa i've been good this year well most of the time okay once in a while never mind i'll buy my own presents i think it's so so cute um so what we have here are the computer and headphone brads i've got the mail brad set with the box and the letter and then this is the claws from the mr and mrs claws brad set super cute Designer Lauren Burgold has made a couple more beachy style holiday cards. They both use our seashell corner brads and they also use our seashell brad sets, as you can see here. 
on the one on the right she's added the blue nutcrackers and some blue pearl bling to the wreath on the one on the left the spray has our um, snowflakes and also some white pearl bling so these make two really nice warm style holiday cards for you ATC traders out there, Leslie Turner created three cards that I'm going to show you real quickly. This one has a background of our wood washi tape and then she die cut the word peace and put a piece of glitter washi tape behind that to set it off. She also has three reindeers on this card. The next one uses our profile and our regular cardinal brad set and then she's also got our gold patterned glitter washi as the background. This is the third one. It's a round shape and it features our tree glitter washi as well as our penguins. Super cool. Lauren Burgold created this super cute little sanitizer and the tag on it says, don't forget your hand sanitizer. And he says, yes, dear. So cute. So what she used here are the Mr. and Mrs. Claus brads, the sleigh brad, the pine tree brads, and the, the uh, snowflake brad. Then the background, this heart was cut out of our Santa washi tape. Uh, she put that on her uh, cardstock before cutting the shape, and that gives you that pretty background. Great idea, and it could be used for either uh, an ornament or on a package. We have a new bread set out there. It's the crab and lobster set, and you'll see those right there. Um, and this one's from Susan Creech. It says, we're in hot water. Sorry, we missed your birthday. That, that's so cute. Um, the pot holder is from our cooking set, and that's a great card. All right, the next card I'm going to show is, is mine, and actually I've got three of them that are all mine that I've done recently. So anyway, this is the first one, Enjoy the Beach Life. This background is a print then cut from Cricut. I've used the sun, uh, sun glasses brad colored. Then there's the seashore brads, which has the sand dollar and the starfish umbrella brad set, the sandcastle brad set, the lobster crab set, uh, lobster from the crab and lobster set, sorry, and the seagull. In these two cards from Lauren Burgle, we get to see the crabs in the crab and lobster set. Both of these cards include our sky washi and gold glitter washi and the crab and lobsters. The left card has added seagull and the right has the sun and clouds and seashell brads. Next up, I've got You're a Lobstar, obviously a word play on rock star, and I use the lobsters in this one, and I also have some washi tape that's the skinny purple glitter, and then the striped colored washi as well. Just love this crab cake card by Susan Matthews. She used the crab and lobster set, the seashell set, the seashore set, which has the starfish, and the orange swirl plural bling on the cake topper and gray pearl bling in the corners. And of course, crabs would eat crab cakes for their birthdays. So I had teased you about a brand new set coming out this month, and here it is. It's our ice cream cones in both chocolate and strawberry and vanilla flavors. So cute. This is a card I made to feature them, and in addition to the cones, I've added some uh, musical notes to simulate music coming out of the ice cream truck. Uh, the street is created using our brick washi, and the background is created using the color wheel washi, and then the edges around this card are the thin brown glitter washi. So I hope you enjoy this new set. There's so much you can do with it. Here's another one by Susan Creech, and it's What's the Scoop? It includes our ice cream brads, and she used pink pearl bling to circle the ice cream cones on that medallion. Then in the background, she's used glitter bow washi, which is really pretty on this card. Love the pinks. And in that same style, Susan's made another card using a similar color scheme and pattern paper. This includes the ice cream cone and our pink heart enamel dot. This is a super apology card that is sure to bring a smile to the person you may have offended. Well, that wraps up all the samples I've got to show you today. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to use your code BROOKRULES for 20% off of everything in the store. This is good again through September 6th. So, thank you for joining us today. Don't forget to visit eyelitoutlet.com for all of your Brad, Washi, and Bling needs. I'm Janet, here for Islet Outlet. Until next time, happy crafting. Bye.